In Project, you can display and hide summary tasks or shove summary tasks down to a specific level of the task outline. That way, you can focus on the tasks you need to see. So here we're looking at a project using the Gantt chart view. If you want to format how this view looks, go to the Format tab on the ribbon. The Format tab is a context-sensitive tab. So when you're looking at the Gantt chart, it has features for formatting a Gantt chart view. For example, we're going to head over to the Show Hide section on the right side of the ribbon. If you want to hide the summary tasks, turn off the Summary Tasks checkbox. That way, all you see are your work tasks. Then, when you're ready to see them again, you can turn the checkbox back on. The Project Summary task is a special task at the top of the project. It has Task ID 0. It's a summary task that Project creates that summarizes everything about the project. For example, we can see the duration of the project here, the start and finish date, and if I displayed other tables, I could see the total cost or the total hours of work. If you want to turn that off for some reason, turn off the Project Summary Task checkbox. However, I find that to be really useful, so I'm going to keep it turned on. The other thing you can do is you can filter to only show a certain number of levels of your project, which could be great for presenting to management. To do that, we're going to head to the View tab on the ribbon. Then, in the Data section, click the Outline button. If you just want to see, let's say, two levels, choose Level 2 on the drop-down list. That way, you'll see everything down to the second level. In this project, we've got some summary tasks at Level 2. There's also one work task at Level 2, and there are a couple of milestones as well. When you're ready to see all of the subtasks again, go back up to the ribbon, click Outline, and then choose All Subtasks. The other thing you can do with summary tasks is you can collapse and expand them. For example, let's look at task 6, Choose New Location. Let's say you want to hide all the subtasks. You can do that two different ways. The one is by clicking the black triangle to the left of the task name. That collapses it. Then, when you're ready to expand it, you can click what is now a white triangle. You can do the same thing from the ribbon by clicking the Outline button and then choosing either Hide Subtasks or Show Subtasks. There you have several techniques for showing and hiding summary tasks and subtasks to focus on different parts of your project.